Hi fashion sewers, in this tutorial I'm going to be showing you how to trim and grade your seams. It's not all about just stitching and pressing in order to get that professional look. I'm Colleen G. Lee and this is Fashion Sewing Blog. Okay here we've got a plain seam as you can see. Now I'm going to show you how to trim the seam. So I'm going to roughly be taking away about 0.5 centimetres, I believe it's about a quarter of an inch. And you usually do this technique when it's you're doing facings or collars and cuffs. So now I've trimmed. And it's all about just getting that neat professional looking garment when you've actually finished. So now that I've trimmed it, I'm going to grade. I'm just going to take one and I'm going to be whoops get my scissors in between that seam there and just take away a little bit more I'm trying to keep my hands quite steady see now that I've got a graded seam now I'm going to be showing you a little bit about um, when you're joining seams together onto another part of a garment. So in order to get the bulk out of the plain seam here, I'm going to cut diagonally. Just there. And then I'm going to cut the other side diagonally. Right, so what I've done is reduced the bulk in this area here. So when I put so when I put this onto another section of the garment, I'm going to be sewing another seam there, which you will call an intersecting seam. And that would look like this here. So now you can see that I've got an intersecting seam there. And I've cut that and reduced the bulk within this seam here. So we've got a seam there, and I've created another seam there, intersecting seam, reduced it by taking away some of the fabric there, so there's less bulk in the seam. And then, I will trim there we go and then I would grade let me see if I can get my scissors in between there so difficult when you when you're doing this in camera and then I would actually Okay, and there we have a trimmed and grayed seam. And then, once that's pressed, you have now reduced all that bulk. And when you turn to the right side, you'll see no ridges and no seams because the seam there and the lower seam, smaller seam there creates a nice finished look. I hope you found that technique useful. It's all about getting a more professional looking seams to your garment so that it doesn't look as homemade. I hope you enjoyed it. I look forward to seeing you in my next video. If you have any comments or questions, please do let me know. Thank you for watching.